Hey, there it is. Okay. I finally finished up the first box from Goodwill. Big 30 pound, well, 29 pound box. It probably was about 7,500 cards. If I did my math right, which probably I didn't, I can't even think straight at this point. Having gone through nine videos total, wanted to show you what I got out of the box in the end. And uh, it actually was pretty decent. First box broke even for both boxes. So as it turns out that this box from Goodwill is probably going to be all the gravy. So hopefully there's some good stuff in here. I'm going to go ahead and open it. Um, the listing picture I don't have to show you handy. Sorry about that. It was There were no unlimited cards showing like the other one. This one they showed off a couple of rares from the Champions of Kamigawa, I think. So we'll probably find that stuff in the top of the box here. Uh, I am hoping that this is from um, similar same collection that did have some of that un unlimited stuff. Um, so we're going to dig through. It might be you know, all the way at the bottom. I'm hoping. I think there's still going to be some decent stuff in here. As you can see, this is how they come from the Seattle Goodwill. Just tossed in there with a cool um, proxy for a Kentoro, sure. So we're gonna go through all of this. I'm going to move this box out of the way and reset the camera and we will start digging in. And if it's anything like the last one, it's gonna take me forever. But if you know me by now, you'll know that I kinda enjoy doing this kind of stuff. Pardon my hairy arm. I'm gonna get this. Try to set this up to where I'm back in business, right? Okay, I think that'll do it. A little test here, grab the first pile out of the box. There, that's what it is. All right. Let's dig in. Here we go again. And yes, basic lands, of course. Gotta have the basic lands. And there's what I'm talking about some Kamigawa rares, Day of Destiny. Legendary creatures you control get plus two, plus two. I'm gonna try to be a little more diligent in um, getting a price on. Uh, things in real time essentially. Hey, don't look at my kids. And that's what we want to look at. We'll let uh, Delver do its thing. Yep, Day of Destiny is. $4.99. So that goes in the good pile. Where is the good pile? Right there. Okay. Yeah, I'm still getting this down, you guys. Um, we'll put, you know, foil stuff. I'm pretty sure it's not anything big. I'll throw it over there, though. Yep, see, this is an uncommon now. And um, what is that? Uh, Masters 2017, I guess. So. Here we go. We're digging again. So the last box had a ton of iconic masters commons that I got really sick of seeing. Looks like he, Masters 2015, I think is what this is. Is going to be <laughs> maybe that's going to be the story of this box. Wouldn't that be hilarious? We'll see. I'm not going to write it off yet. And some fate reforged stuff. Yep, yep. Yeah, there's always gonna be plenty of comments and stuff in these. 
I really did okay on the last one. So ready for some gravy. Like this Sensei Golden Tail. Pull that one out and see what it comes up as. Buck 81, sure. Sure, sure, sure. And back to work. Still testing the theory on if uh, the different Goodwills um, are good at staging these to trick you. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and be the the guy that gets tricked for you. So like this right here was probably right on top of the uh, the uh, listing, and that's eight bucks. So if if that's the only good cards in this box, then that um, oops, we didn't get that twice, right? I just wanted you to be able to see. Um, then we know that they're pulling a fast one. Everything from here is all mystery. Like, yeah, okay, Masako the Humorless. I don't think she's anything, right? Yeah, two bucks. Looks like somebody had a Champions Kamigawa deck in these orange sleeves, so we'll be on the lookout for those. Search continues. And trying to make sure that the glare is not too bad. Some onslaught stuff there. We found very little onslaught stuff in the last box. Walker of Secret Ways. Let's look. Still got it. Nope, that's a nothing. See, that's kind of nice. This one's got some writing on it, so it goes in the garbage. All right, first out of the box was the only thing that was interesting from the listing picture. Let's see how well picked this is beyond that. I don't know all the commons and uncommons in and out of these sets. Some of them, there's a couple snakes that are okay. I don't think that was one of them. Let's take a look. What's the glare situation? You're going to have it angled like that. The last box was completely all over the place. I, I expect the same from this one. We pulled out everything from Unlimited to uh, Our Devastation, actually Rivals of Ixalan uh, from the last box. So I kind of expect the same. So Seed of the Synod, that's going to be a buck or so back here. Why not? Well, change the edition. Mirrodin, yeah, buck 42. And a Vault of Whispers, I think it's a little less, but here's a couple of them. We'll take those. Here is some Revised. That's not a rare or anything. Aurorix Blade Wing, I'm pretty sure is a bulk. Yep, it is, but it goes in the pile. Splice into Arcane. Nope. See there? Oh, okay. There's a rare Toshiro Umizawa. Um, he's worth a little bit. 
but his jitty worth a little bit more. Danger. Take a jitty. Knocking stuff over on the right here. Some proxy stuff. Ancient Den is a artifact land. So it's two ninety nine. That's a winner in my book. Some of the, a lot of this stuff's got some grit in between the cards. So it got played with that sleeve. This one got played with a sleeve. Take it out. Check out the price because I have not seen that card before. Two sixty six for Soul Foundry. Yeah, I'll just put it back in the sleeve. Keep it from getting messed up, right? I don't think that's anything. All right, not too shabby. Fourth edition stuff. Some invasion stuff and apocalypse. Just again, all over the place. I'm just, I'm happy it's not just pure 100% Fate Reforged Commons or Iconic Masters Commons in, you know, basic lands from some other country. Ah, take a foil basic land, right? Or if the, uh, the Delver can figure out what that is. It knows it's a swamp from Odyssey. Tell it it's a foil. Doesn't know the price. That's all right. I figure it's, you know, up to 50 cents. Typically, you sell those bulk, you get like 30 35 cents for a nice big set of foil basic lands. Egg Watcher is probably nothing. And it is nothing, yep. I love the Delver, it's pretty quick. I've, uh, I haven't tried uh, TCG Player's recognition app for this particular project yet but i may give that a try in the future just for comparison i find this one's real quick because it's made for sorting and i'm using it mainly for just price checking and the tcg player app probably wants to try to sell you cards more is my guess so I'll do a comparison at some point a bunch of swamps the mirrodin or Phyrexia block, it's cool. Yeah, it's a pretty cool red sun there. But, that's not what we're looking for. Now here's a stack of orange sleeves. Let's see if we can get the rest of this deck here. And hopefully some good older cards that just got forgotten about. A, what is that, a U? What does that even mean? What proxy is that for? Now it's trash now. Yeah, we got Masters. I looked that up. Is that 2015? Let's see what the, the Delver says. No, it's not a Shadow Moor. Modern Masters 2015, right? Not a foil. Yep, yep, they're gonna be seeing some of that stuff. So here's some sleeves. Oh, here's an empty sleeve. It took something to get out of there, right? In fact, all of these are, they're all empty sleeves. Psych, nope, oh, there's a proxy for what, Savannah Lions? Sure enough. Another Kentaro, let's see what's on the back. Let me guess, uh, Mox Sapphire, nope. 
Good thing it wasn't. Back to the fate reforged. And the Conda's banner. And another sensei. Yeah, two sensei golden tails. Cool. That one is eight. And these ones were two or something, right? And then we'll tell it there's two, sure. Buck 81. Great. Love it. Yeah, this is all common stuff. Another Kentaro. No point in looking, but that's all right. I still did it anyway. Looks like my phone is telling me I have a time limit. Same time limit I usually have. It's like 31 minutes this video can be. Which, uh, ironically, I actually have a little bit more time today. But I will still probably stop the video at that point and make this another nine part series going through boxes this one box nope but like i said before i was gonna do this anyway let's see we're gonna use a pale curtain i don't know what that is i'm sure it's gonna wreck his opponent though all right let's grab this side this time Islands and I guess it's fourth edition brutes. Uh, the brute's not a rare, is he? Well, it's not from Legends either, but definitely a common. So Delver is usually pretty good. Sometimes it has trouble telling what edition you just showed it, and um, part of the problem is that I'm using my old phone which is my old phone for a reason. It's kind of on its way out. But it still serves as a card recognizer. Tree of Tales is another artifact land. It's like a buck, wrong edition, yeah. Geyser, I don't think is anything. Always check red cards that give you mana. Because some of them are pretty decent. See, like Lorwyn, Dragon's Maze, and then there's a Ponder right there. So we'll take a Ponder. I don't think a stream bed Aquatex is anything. I know some of these merfolks take off and they look just like every other merfolk, so you gotta kind of check them. I do anyway. Nope. Alright, I'm getting somewhere. Grab another stack. I'd love to see some more unlimited cards. I'll take a alliances card that's probably just a common. It's an uncommon, but it's not anything I'm gonna keep. so they're easier to go through. And if there's nothing great inside of it. There's a rare from Plane Shift. 
It is a bulk rare. I'll take it. Let's see here. I'm trying to show off here, so I'll leave my good pile right here. The good pile's kind of in the way, the way I'm set up here, so. We'll live, right? Basic lands, nothing big there. Wow, there's a ninja of the deep hours. It's a buck, right? Guess I don't have to price check stuff that I'm really confident is worth a certain amount. Kind of a habit, I guess. Should just keep it for stuff that I don't know what it is, right? Right. So is, is this fourth edition or is that Chronicles, you guys? Tell me. It's fourth edition, right? Yep. See, now this is Chronicles. It's got the set symbol. This thing's stuck on Alibaba. There we go, Active Volcano Chronicles. Yep, it recognized it. So the Bird Maiden, without the Arabian Nights symbol, that should be fourth edition. Or, no, it's gotta be fourth, not fifth. Fourth edition, yep. Just a few things you gotta remember about cards if you're gonna pick through them. Just gotta know everything there is to know. It's easy. Now we left this all the fourth edition Took all the revised and older. Let's see what a flash fires does for us. Nope, it's an uncommon and a rogue elephant from Weatherlight is a common. Looks like. Okay. The struggle continues, the struggle is real. Free from the real should be worth picking. 79 cents, gets me the little bling noise, just like gambling. It's a lot. Very similar to what this really is. This is not investing. This is gambling. This keeps me from going and messing around with slot machines, right? Thought prison. We can look at it. I'm not sure. And now I know that it's not worth anything, and knowing is half the battle. Chatter of the squirrel. Let's see if there's any squirrel love for that. Nah, it's not good enough for Sachi. Let's see what Sachi tells us. Doesn't give me a price. 25 cents, which means it's bulk. Because the buy list is going to be low. This is an uncommon legendary land, God's Eye. Gate to the Recce. It is not uncommon enough. A couple of uncommon. Let's check out this. 
Uh, Crest Lake is a nope. Tranquil Garden, probably the same. Yeah, those are not interesting enough. Another Ninja. Okay. Nature's Revolt, I'm pretty sure it's bulk. I ran into that in the last box. Yeah, it's nothing big. Some Origins. Fist of Ironwood, I'm pretty sure it's nothing, right? Yeah, no, that's nothing. Elder is, well, it's wrong edition. Hold on. Champions of Kamigawa. It is a buck. So we'll pull those when we see them. That's, I think the only snake commons are the ones that are like one mana that are going to be worth looking at. I don't think any of these go. And here's a bunch of empty sleeves, so it's weird. They took they left the rares in the orange sleeves and they took everything else out. This nature's revolt was bulk. It's nothing. Misblade Shinobi is Nothing. Whoops. <laughs> it's got a little bit of adjusting to do here with my setup, you guys, if you can't tell. Stir the grave. I think these are nothing, right? No. No. It's nothing. Cut. Oh yeah, there's a couple more here. There is a rare from Odyssey there. Hey, it's actually a good one. Five bucks for Seize the Day. Cool. Getting there. So I got enough time for one more grab. I'll try not to grab this bunch of basic lands right at the top here. I'll try to find something somewhat interesting. I can't even tell. Part of me wants to dig through this whole box right now, but I wouldn't get it on camera. I'd go consign myself to this lifestyle now. <laughs> no problem. I'll just look at all these tokens. They are cool. They are pretty cool. This is not the pile I wanted to grab, but it's the one I deserve, obviously. Yeah, a bunch of tokens right there. Oh, gosh. All right, next video, I will be fixing something. I have no idea how or what. Okay, well, we got a whole mess of tokens here. And these tip cards. Go through tokens and tip cards to get through to the good stuff, right? I'm sure they left all the good stuff right after this. <laughs> sorting, sorting, tossing, sorting, tossing. Nope. Oh no, my favorite iconic masters commons. Oh, the mannequin. Oh no. Well, they're back. Maybe this is part of that same collection. Got thrown all, thrown all into the same box. We got a Joven, which is nothing. Some evaporates, which are nothing. Bestial Fairies, I believe, are nothing. Come on, is it nothing? That's nothing, all right. 
So, but you can check out this Soul Shriek from Mirage. Find that it is nothing. A portal checklist. You see that too often. There's a rare from Ixlan, Ingrass Marauders. Probably nothing too exciting. Nope. Bolters, Medusa, no. Feeblement, no. Tempest stuff. Um, there's nothing from Weatherlight. Might get in there. Okay, no, nope, didn't find anything. So, found a few good things right in the top here. Basically, the stuff that was in the listing um, that we could see. So, about to run out of time. Signing off. This was box two. Here we go. Down the rabbit hole. Subscribe, like, share. Scream and yell down below. Thank you very much.